Hello everybody, my name is Emeris and today we are going to download and install Vector Linux operating system. First you have to go to Google and write Google and type in Vector Linux. This is the official page, click on it and then download and you, you can to select the, the version that you want I'm going to select the first one but I have already downloaded it for this reason I don't have to wait for, for more time but you wait and then first we have to set up our virtual box manager click on new and you have to put a name wherever that you want in this case i'm going to put my name and then choose the type in this case is linux and the, the version Vector is not here, uh, for this reason I'm going to put other Linux 64 bits, depending the, the, the type of the operating system. Next, and select the memory RAM. I'm going to choose 1 GB. Next, then select the second one. Create a virtual hard disk. Click on create. Then the first one, the first one option, and that's a virtual box disk image. And then click on next. Dynamical allocate. Next. And then choose the the storage for the hard disk I'm going to choose approximately 50 gigabytes and click on create and that's it this is our virtual box manager but you have to set up it Click on settings and storage. Storage uh, in this disk and then in this disk for choose the device that have the image or, or the boat table table device in this case I have my system in house drive page but if you have a ISO image you have to choose in this part okay. and that's it click on OK start Wait. press enter key Vector installer shows there's a problem with it. Also, 
automatic, choose automatic and forward. I have chosen Vector because I want to work with a different operating system but I didn't want to, it was common and I watched some screenshot interfaces of Vector and I decided to install it It takes some minutes. Well, we have installed Vector Linux 7 in our computer, and that's all. Subscribe and give it like. Goodbye, see you soon.